I'm Heather, and here at M3 Design, we are celebrating the return of autumn and the cooler weather with our annual Pumpkin Chunkin' event. Uh, you can see going on behind me, there's a couple engineers and designers uh, designing some devices to throw pumpkins around. Every year here, we like to have uh, one or two team building events, just a way for our engineers and designers to put their skills to the test. So you can see on the floor behind me, we've actually got two bullseyes. Uh, laid out. One's at 15 feet and the second one's at 30 feet and our teams have been tasked with taking three launches and getting as many points as possible. So we give each of the teams a, a kit of building materials in the one Ziploc bag. Uh, I think this year it was 75 popsicle sticks, some Elmer glue, uh, some super glue, some electrical tape, some paper clips. Uh, so rules for the pumpkin chunking competition. You have a small little plastic pumpkin. That's the pumpkin you have to launch uh, down our hallway. Can't modify it. it, has to be a pumpkin when you launch it. Uh, we do have some sneaky people that try to melt it down every once in a while, so that's an important rule. Uh, you've gotta build a device with the materials that you're given. The other rules are you have to put your device on the ground. Uh, you can't touch the pumpkin while your device is launching it. Uh, but you can hold down or actuate the launching mechanism. And then the device has to stay stationary on the ground so you can't actually physically hold it down uh, while it's launching. You can modify the kit materials, put them together any way you want, but you can't add to it, and you gotta launch that pumpkin. I think we have about eight teams this year, uh, everybody working together to build their one single prototype. They have a full week to work together, with the, come up with their design, and put the materials together, actually build it. We lay out the bullseyes ahead of time, that way they can get a couple practice shots in, uh, test their devices and modify it if they need it. Uh, and then on launch day, they've got three attempts uh, to launch their pumpkin, and the score is added in. So the winner of this year's competition gets a terrible, horribly obnoxious pumpkin trophy and uh, a jack-o'-lantern full of candy corns and pumpkin uh, candy. So should be a lot of fun. Also, the glory of winning may be the most important part.